friends, Amazon Prime Day tomorrow, and I'm not going to buy anything to squeeze in this closet because I really need to take half of this out and donate it to charity. This is summer things here, and I need to take some of this stuff out. I'm not looking at one article of clothing on Prime Day at Amazon. I swear and I promise. I really am. A few of my hats here. Happy shopping! friends, after a long day of Amazon Prime shopping, what did I do? I cooked Hubby and I some Faro Island salmon that I order from QVC. This is the most delicious salmon. I order it frozen and I order the 18 pack at a time and I always have it in my freezer and my friend, it is boneless, it's skinless and oh my word, it's delicious. Okay, friends, this is dinner. This is actually what I ate. I eat for dinner. I have the Faro Island salmon, as I just showed you cooking, the six ounce, the homegrown red tomatoes with homemade whipped potatoes, and a little six ounce glass of my almond milk. That is my typical dinner. I will substitute the the salmon for chicken or turkey, but that's basically a dinner for me with a substitute of a couple sides. Hello my friends, it's Lee and welcome back to Beauty Over 70 with Lee. Hope everybody's having a great day today and I'm excited to show you some products that I absolutely could not resist on Amazon Prime Day. I think everybody's doing a video about what they bought on Prime Day and uh, that was I think the 12th and 13th if I remember correctly and you know I love to shop and I got in trouble. <laughs> I got some things, a lot of things that I needed. I got a lot of things I did not need, but I wanted them and it was a good day to pick up those Prime Day specials. And yeah, I don't do a lot of Christmas shopping, but I did pick up a couple things. Mostly it was just things that I really, really needed. A couple things I could live without, but you know, they came to visit me anyway, so. What can I say? But anyway, welcome. I'm Lee, and this is Beauty Over 70 with Lee. If you're new, I welcome you to my channel, and I welcome you to hit that subscribe button uh, if you like the content. And uh, stick around. I'm going to show you. I've got a lot of things to cover, uh, so I'm going to show you some of the things that I did purchase. A couple I'm not going to show you, but uh, most of them I'm going to share with my friends what I did buy on Amazon Prime Day. Um, what would we do without Amazon? I mean, I really don't know. I really don't know what this house would do without Amazon because I buy everything from a lot of cosmetics to uh, household products. Uh, I found a great deal on uh, Cascade uh, dishwasher tabs. And uh, so I picked up, I picked up those. And uh, so, okay, let's get going here. I've got my list going. Um, I'm doing much better. I'm doing much better. Thank you. Uh, thank you for your, your, your love and your prayers uh, in the comment section when I had all that dental work and I'm still not over it, but uh, I'm doing much better. So thank you so much from the bottom of my heart 
for remembering me in your prayers when I'm going through this ordeal. So I am doing much better. Still not out of it, still not complete, still not done, but I'm doing better. So thank you, thank you, thank you. And start with the very first thing here on this, um, um, my list. Um, I found these little brush sets. Now, does Lee need any makeup brushes? No. The answer is capital N-O. But I found these little D, capital D, capital U, care, do care, three-piece brush set. So I ordered one of these, so I'm anxious to see how they're going to wear. And I have not used these, so I'm gonna share these with my friends. They're called Do Care, Do Care. And these were a set of three, and they were $9.99, ladies. They are synthetic hair, and they do have uh, wooden handles. There's a set of three, as you can see. There is a foundation brush, and it is labeled foundation, and I chose the white. You could get the white or the black. Uh, most of my brushes are, uh, are black handle, but I chose the white in these. Um, I'm trying to, um, it's very, very plain to see what it says there, and it's sloped, and it does have this little, this little guard on it, which I like to put that on there to, uh, when I wash the brushes, that's what I'm, when you're saying this little plastic sleeve thing comes, you know, that's what that is. And that's what, when I wash my brushes, this is what I put the brush back down in. So that's what I'm referring to is that little sleeve. But if you can see the way it's tapered, this is a foundation brush. That would be absolutely perfect for a blush brush, I think, to pat that on. Uh, because I do like a flat, um, a flat brush to do my, my uh, foundation, but I think that would be perfect for, but we'll see when I get into it. And there's also a concealer brush, which is small, and these are very, very dense. These are dense brushes, so I think this is going to hold up real well for $10 for three. So this is a concealer brush, and we'll see what I use that for. And uh, there is also a blush brush, which I think I like the foundation better for blush than that. This is more, you know, foundation, but, oh, I don't know. I don't know what I'll use it for. I may end up giving it to my granddaughter, who knows, or one of the granddaughters or, you know. But anyway, that's a set of three of Do Care brushes, white handle that I chose for $9.99, and that was on Amazon Prime Day. And you know, I've talked about one product and I've already went five minutes, so I need to get moving along here. Um, I picked up a three-piece uh, towel set for the hair. These little turban, um, these little microfiber um, towels for the hair. And I don't know why, because I don't have any hair. Um, I could just dry mine, mine dries by the time I blah, 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 and I'm in the, you know, step out of the shower my hair dries just like that <laughs> but anyway i got a set of three and they were 13.99 for a set of three but i chose these and um so these are good i'm going to put i got the gray you can get them in different colors i got the gray the light gray and the pink that was the selection the three colors that i chose and they're just the little turban as you can see Put your hair in there, which I don't have any to put in there. And you just roll it around and clip it. And I'm not going to put this on my hair, but anyway. That is the three-piece towel set that I got for $13.99 on Amazon Prime Day. And I think I will, I think I will like these and I think I will use these. So anyway, that is what I got there. And I want to show you an HB Life pencil holder that I picked up. Do I need any more organization? I don't think so, but I felt like I had to have this little holder. And I found this was on Prime Day Special for $7.99. And this holds 26 pencils. And you can see the way it's tapered back here. This back row is, is up to where if you put, <coughs> uh, excuse me, if you put a pencil in there and then you put a pencil in front 
of that, then you could still see about that much of the back pencil so you know what color you are going after. That fits eye pencils or lip pencils, and it will hold 10 of these, and then it'll hold six of the uh, down here if they're larger, like the big jumbos or something. So I can use that. I can use it for something. It'll keep me real organized when I'm down here in my basement filming. So that, that'll work out great. So that was $7.99, and it's acrylic. And um, it does come with little tabs on the bottom so it won't slip. And it's very sturdy made. And I think this will be um, as well worth $7.99. And pencil, I showed you that, the pencils. I did order one of the NYX eyebrow pencil, not eyebrow, excuse me, eye pencils. And this happens to be in the, it's kind of a, a dark plum color. And it's called... Um, Berry Goth, Berry Goth, and that's a pretty color. I chose that. I didn't have anything in that color, so I felt like I needed that, and that was a real good day on Amazon Prime Day on the NYX. They had most of these little crayons on, color, on sale, and I picked up one. So I'll show it to you. It's the uh, e.l.f. HD Finishing Powder. And it was on sale for $6. It has a little mirror compact there. There's no sponge or anything. But um, it it's for the blurring. And I went ahead and picked that up because I do like this. And I needed a new one. So I picked up that for $6 on e.l.f. Stay All Night Micro Fine Setting Mist setting spray. This is a good product. It is. There's setting sprays that I like a lot better, but I do like, you know, just this is a good setting spray for the money. And this was also $6. So I landed both of those for $6 and that for $12 for two. And this is a, a good setting spray for $6 from e.l.f. So that's what I got, ladies. I ended up with, I chose three of the NYX lip gloss. I chose a red, which I needed a new red with holidays just around the corner. I chose a pink, and don't go by that color because that is much, much lighter than it shows. It looks more like a fuchsia bubble gum, but it is much lighter than that color. And I also chose a lighter rose color. And I like these because they're easy to store. There's not a ton in there. So I think I'm going to put just a little bit on here and show you. And it's no bad taste either. So the little nicks. And these were hardly anything. I think they were, what, three... Three dollars or something like that. So I just picked up three little, three colors that I can use. And uh, I can't go wrong with NYX. They were really, well, I think they were three dollars. Don't hold me to that, but I believe they were three dollars. But I'll list everything in the description box. And another, pro and I think they're about three, three and a half inches tall. But it's a, a very well-made acrylic. I think this was seven six ninety nine or seven ninety nine, and I thought this holds. Like I said, it's at three three and a half inches tall, and it holds six. Dip, there's six, six different slots here, you know, three and three. And I thought this would be perfect for me to keep down here that I can just put a little label on the front, and uh, then I'll just put my my makeup brushes and my powder brushes behind that and my uh, uh, blush brushes and my contour brushes and my eye brushes and keep them all separated right there and it's everything is right there nice and handy. Of course, if you wanted to use it on the desk for pens and markers and things like that, it would be a great deal too. But that's what I picked it up to use for brushes down here. So. That's what I do. And like I said, I got a couple of the Cascade dish tabs, which was a fantastic deal on Amazon Prime Day. And I got several other things. Uh, like I said, I got posted. I got markers. It's like any time back to school, when school is getting ready to start, any time, whether you're 
doing on Amazon Prime or you go into your local Walmart or wherever you shop at, it's uh, it's always good to pick up and replenish, um, you know, inks and papers and post-its and markers and all kinds of things on that time. That's when we do it anyway. But I want to show you a pair of shoes that I bought. I love these shoes. This is probably my third or fourth pair of shoes that I have purchased with this brand of this particular same brand, not only the same brand, but the same brand of shoe. And there's a big difference because you can't go across the board with the same shoe. But I want to show you this and um, I'll, I'm going to put a picture up when I edit this. I'm going to put a picture of the shoes up. But these happen to be, I love these shoes. I love these shoes. I love Under Armour shoes. And um, that's the brand they are, Under Armour. Can you see me under there? Under Armour. And these shoes were... They are charged asset. Charged asset is the is the brand on these shoes. Their name on these shoes, rather. And I want to show you this. And they had. I've been waiting for these to come back in stock. Uh, not in style. I've been waiting for them to come back in stock because they have been out for quite some time. And I have these shoes in two tones of gray, a light and dark gray. I also have these shoes in a black and white that I've had. And there was another color, seemed like they were fuchsia and black, but they're actually a running shoe. And why do I like a running shoe? No, I do not run anymore, but I do a lot of walking. I like a running shoe because they're light, but this shoe has fantastic support. And without further ado, I want to show you my shoes, ladies. These are Under Armour, and they are Charged Asset is the name of the, of the shoe. I happen to choose the black with the, it says pink. It's kind of a pinky coral. And just look at that. That shoe is just, it's just screams. It's charged A-S-S-E-R-T. And there is so much opening right here. I don't like a shoe that has a lot of hard of um, piece right here because I have toenail issues that I can't stand anything. To, I keep my toenails super cut when I go get pedicures. But there's mesh right there to where on the toe box is extra wide. It's kind of like a Rika shoe. It's got the point here um, with the tongue. There's extra cushion in here. It's got the little thing on the back where you can pull it on, easy on, easy off. It doesn't have those super long shoe strings to where when you tie them, they drag the ground. But I chose the pink with the little Under Armour logo there on both sides. And that is the shoe that I chose. And I do wear an eight and a half. And I want to show you the bottom. This is absolutely shock absorbent. This is absolutely fantastic. I hate to wear them because they're so pretty on the back, but just look at that. That just screams comfort. It really absorbs the shock, shock absorbent. And um, I can't say enough about this shoe. Like I said, this is my fourth pair of this charged assert. And um, I will absolutely, they're soft. But like I said, through there, I really, really like that. But these shoes were regularly $70, and I think they were $63, maybe $62.99. I saved a little bit on them. It was a good time to get them, and it was a good thing I did because I was looking. I went back and looked when I was reviewing my orders, and I saw it unavailable 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 so hubby got a pair too he chose the bright orange and uh, i chose the kind of coral pink color but i just i just love that shoe so i wanted to share that with you and um, so anyway that about wraps it up that is what i wanted to share on amazon prime day uh like i said i probably picked up two or three more items that i didn't 
want to bore you with. Like I said, their office supplies and cleaning supplies. I did get some Mrs. Myers and things like that for cleaning, but uh, I didn't want to bore you with things like that. But uh, uh, again, I thank you for your time. And uh, but oh, there's one thing I want to to say before um, before I let you go today. I received an absolutely beautiful, beautiful card from one of my viewers, and her name is Adina. And Adina, I have not got around to thanking you yet, but I'm going to, to um, uh, I hope you're watching. And Adina lives in my state, and she is just the most absolute, wonderful, precious person that she is subscribed uh, to my channel. And she messaged me and asked me for my address and I gave it to her so she could send me a belated late birthday card. My birthday was in June and I got the card and I really intended to bring it down here and show it to you, but I will in another video. I will bring it down and I will open it and I'll let you see the card, but she is just um, Anna Griffin, I think is the paperwork that she used on it. And um, it's absolutely beautiful, but I will show you that. But I'm going to put my address, I do have a P.O. box, and I'm going to put my address in the description box and put it in the default where it'll always be there. So if any time anybody wants to send anything, a card or something like that, it will be there. So just look in the description box and you will see uh, my P.O. box number. So if you want to, to send anything in the future. And uh, again, I'm going to wrap this up before my little camera here starts saying you're out of time again. You've talked too much. I want to thank you for your time. I want to thank you for uh, allowing me to show you what I bought on Amazon Prime Day. And I hope you bought a lot of good bargains too and did a lot of shopping. And uh, just leave some, let me comment in the comment section and let me know if you purchase any of things that I purchased. Um, and, um, you know, I'd be interested to know if anybody hit the jackpot and ended up with what I did. So again, I want to thank you for your time. And again, if you haven't subscribed to my channel and you like my content, please subscribe and uh, do leave me a comment. And um, again, I thank you from the bottom of my heart. And I always want to leave you with my favorite words. Go out and make today better than yesterday. And just remember that Lee loves you.